Swifties, are you ready for it? Taylor Swift mania, it is taking over and setting South Florida in a lavender haze tonight. You know, this is the site night one of three enchanted evenings for the Eras Tour at Hard Rock Stadium. That's sure to knock things out of the woods. <laughs> the <laughs> long awaited cruel summer, it's over, but Swifties will be enchanted to see Taylor take the stage. And yes, if you're wondering why we're saying all these words, these are Taylor Swift songs. We got to weave them in here to the yeah, show. Yeah, Austin was very <laughs> proud of himself. You know, it's time to shake it off as the hottest and biggest tour in the world is finally here and it is sure to make sparks fly. It is. Let's get to our Morgan Ryder right now. She's live at Hard Rock Stadium. The excitement building there ahead of tonight's first show. Hey, Morgan. All right, guys, I love what you did there. I see it and I am going to raise you. Austin, Betty, count and see if you can count how many I'm about to give you. You may think you know Hard Rock Stadium all too well, but in the name of being honest, I have to tell you tonight is not going to be like any other night, any other concert or game you may have been to. They are really going to step up security here. Parking opens up at 3.30 this afternoon, and you will not be allowed to line up before the gates open. Open, but don't hold out for a blank space. You must have a parking pass and a ticket to that night's show to park and be on Hard Rock property. You should expect to go through multiple security and ticket checks before entering the stadium. Now, once inside, you should also expect to get your ticket checked multiple times. And speaking of not being the girl at home and going inside, stadium gates will open at 430. Now, if you don't have a ticket, do not come to Hard Rock Stadium because fans without a ticket will not be allowed on stadium property. There are no listening areas outside the stadium if you don't have a ticket. Now, speaking of tickets, here is what you're looking at when it comes to prices. This is a look at the cheapest resale prices for tonight. On StubHub, one obstructed view ticket behind the stage in the 300 level will run you around $1,000. It's similar on SeatGeek. That's with fees. There are no fees on TickPick, but one obstructed view ticket behind the stage is also around $1,000. Now, if you want to actually see the stage, it will be over $2,000 at least. Also, unlike other shows, there are no tickets available on Ticketmaster unless you get a last minute code. Hotels in Miami Dade County are filling up, and fans we spoke with said the experience and merchandise will forever and always be worth the price. So, mom and, and mom and dad, you're spending a pretty penny out here, right? We are! Yeah! <laughs> I haven't been told what we've spent yet, so. You have not been told. And I haven't asked. Oh, okay. I'll so. get the Amex bill. We're good. <laughs> And if you think you should have said no to driving, Brightline is offering a first of its kind Swifty experience. You can hop on this sing along train from stations in Broward, I mean, in West Palm, in Orlando. It'll take you here to Aventura. From Aventura, there will be transfers to Hard Rock Stadium. In Miami Gardens, Morgan Reiner, CBS News, Miami. Morgan, Morgan, go ahead and get in your getaway car because you won the song game. <laughs> that was great. Thank you. Yes, 